Hey there friends, it is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm back with another quick TubeBuddy tutorial. Now, sometimes I make videos that are quite large, and when you upload a video that's large and you have slow internet like I do at the moment, uh, you have a long time to wait before you can take care of your title. Let me show you a trick I've got so that you can take care of that title immediately. So I actually used the technique with this video. This video was about 14 minutes long and it ended up being a three gigabyte upload, uh, which just takes about 15 minutes to 20 minutes on my internet. And I didn't want to wait that long. I wanted to hit the title and hit publish so I could walk away and get things done. So what I did was I went back to my video editing software and you can do this from wherever you can get a screenshot. And if I do control F, it takes a screenshot that I was then able to import into a different movie so normally I put these screenshots in the media bin because I use them but this time I'm not and I'm gonna close the video because I'm done with this part of the process all right so this video was uploading now of course it is finished but when it was uploading I could not get to the cool create a thumbnail button so here was my solution I simply went to the video manager and I wanted to find a private video that hadn't really been used it was just one that i had put up and there was something broke about it but then what's cool was i was able to open and edit that tiny video and you can see how this says best of instagram it actually has nothing to do with that anymore because i put this title in and all i did was went to create thumbnail and then instead of the still frame or solid color i uploaded the image that i saved a moment ago so when I go to screenshots, I just search by date modified, switch it to the current date, and then I can bring up that picture that I just brought in, click it to include it, tell it continue, find my template, and boom, drop in all the cool stuff and arrange it so that it looks the way I want. And I can even clarify this. I'm going to say wooded and paved paths let's make sure we add a d on that so by showing you this trick i also get to double check my video and make sure it's even a little bit more accurate i think i'm going to drop that down here and i'm going to straighten it out Let's hit continue and save and publish and tell it OK. Now this adjusts back here, but it doesn't matter because it's on an invisible video. It's on one that is private. And then after a moment, you get the magic download thumbnail button, which makes the rest of this all come together. I'm going to put it back in that screenshots. And this I'm going to put PP2 for Puppy Paths 2 and save it. And then I'm going to finally return to that original video and see where it had the paths and paved. This time, I'm gonna click here to upload a new custom thumbnail. Once again, it make my life easier by searching by date, and there is my new one that has the awesome wooded paths mentioned as well. Alrighty, friends, so let's summarize this real quickly. Uh, one, I have a fake video that is marked as private so that I can get to it easy for making my titles whenever I'm waiting on another video to upload. Two, I need to get a screenshot from my software or just have a cool screenshot. And then I just use TubeBuddy in the fake video to make the title that I want with the screenshot from the other one. Works out pretty slick and lets me keep my workflow going even while I'm waiting for my slow internet. Friends, if you found this useful, please hit that like button. If you've got a question, comment, or a suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Mash that subscribe button. And of course, if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech, hit that notification bell. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.